Great to have you today. Good to see your smiling face. Let's see if we can't find you. Oh, here's a great spot right there. There you go. No, I, I always sit there. Well, there's somebody in that seat right now. So yeah, I, I, know. I, I always sit there. I have to sit there. Okay, look, doesn't hurt to ask, does it? <laughs> Pardon me, ma'am. Excuse me. Do you mind uh, just scooching over, just a uh, skosh? <laughs> oh, hey, do you guys need a seat? Uh, let me usher you to your pew. We're all familiar with ushers, aren't we? I mean, maybe not the multi-faceted pop star usher, but you know, the people that direct us to our seats at sporting events or theater shows. But why ushers in the church? I mean, we all know where we sit, don't we? In the exact same spot, every single week, without fail. And don't even, yeah, don't even think about trying to mix it up. So, uh, aside from helping parishioners find their pew, what role does the usher have in our worship service? Hopefully not referee. We're talking about the usher on this episode of Chuck Knows Church. In many churches, it's the church usher who is the first person to represent the church to anyone entering a service. Even though it's a volunteer position, it can be thought of as a very prominent role. Now in some congregations, it's considered an honor to be an usher or the head usher. Sometimes it's even a position selected by a committee, which further highlights the role's symbolic importance. Now, today, the church usher has plenty of duties besides representing the church to visitors. Um, they clean and prepare the sanctuary prior to service, uh, distribute the bulletins, collect offerings, uh, perhaps show people to communion at the front, and they uh, try to find the best up-and-coming singer to be on their team. That is the not the right usher. Again, I messed up that usher. <clears throat> Ah, they do typically have the pastor's back, should the pastor need help with anything. Um, there's always special needs to consider, and knowing the unique temperament of the parishioners is very helpful. An usher is uh, kind of the go-to person when something is needed, uh, good or bad. They keep things under control, even if it means they have to enforce church law. No, that might be a little, that's a little too much power. Probably. Um, but we can say it would be difficult to have worship without them. Um, now, some ushers pray with. Some ushers pray with the clergy before the service, uh, preparing themselves uh, spiritually in order that the worship service can stay focused and present with God. You, up on your feet. On now, up on your feet, hug it out, become friends right now. Thank you. Now assert each other's personhood. Assert, thank you. Now pinky swear your undying love. Pinky swear your undying love now. Thank you. Isn't that better? There you go. It is a vital, worthwhile role in the church and should never be underestimated. Do you hear me? Now, if you'd like to learn more, you can ask your usher. Ah, I mean, uh, pastor. Tell them Chuck sent you. Look at that. Would you look what we did? We made friends right here on Chuck Nose Church. Hey, guys, right now, tweet to all of your followers about your new friendship. Yeah, tweet it. Just let's make it official, right? There you go.